If you guys aren't used to me coming on camera looking like a hot potato yet, you should get used to it because the Lord knows that it is a special day if I get ready. Oh my goodness, I severely underestimated having a newborn again. Yikes. But today we are here on my main channel because I don't know, I thought it was weird. Like my kids are not in this video. So I wanted you guys to be able to comment on my second channel. But then I was like, this channel is my family channel though. You know what I mean? So I felt like it would be weird to do a haul on my second channel of kids clothes. Anyways, today that's exactly what we're doing. I ordered from a store called Pat Pat. I'll show you one of the packagings here just so you guys get the logo and the brand. I saw this through, I think like a YouTube ad video and I ended up going on the website and guys, like I was genuinely so excited. It seemed like everything was super affordable. They had like the cutest clothes. I haven't really browsed very much for like myself, but for my kids, I got a whole bunch of stuff. I will say, however, I ordered this stuff in the middle of April and then the whole COVID thing happened and my package got pushed back literally two months. So I ordered Hunter probably three outfits and I don't think he's gonna fit in any of them because I got three to six months and he's pretty much in six to nine months clothing right now. Sometimes we get lucky where they run a little bit bigger but it's it's mostly six to nine, so I'm super bummed out. I don't think he's gonna fit in the outfits that I get, but it'll be a cool way for me to figure out how the kind of return policy um, of this video is. So excuse me if the video doesn't get out right away. It might, honestly, I might just push the video out so you guys can see the items that we get, and then if I, you know, return or something, uh, I'll, you know, if I remember, I'll come back on here. My brain is absolute mush, so please kindly remind me. If these things might fit, but if there is, if I go through the, the process of returning, um, I'll put like down in the description or something how that was. Cause I actually have like never returned anything that I bought online ever. So <laughs> with that being said, I have a ton to show you guys. So I'm just going to get right into it. The first thing that I'm going to show you actually did not come from this store. However, it came from Amazon. So I'm going to leave it linked down below, but I did just kind of like want to rave about this product real quick. So because everything has been closed, I think today, today was the first day that I saw like the mall was back open. Um, so things are like slowly opening back up. So I haven't been able to like Walmart's been sold out of everything. Target, I was having a hard time finding the right sizes. So nine times out of 10, I would end up ordering my kids clothing online. So that's what I did. Hunter really needed a sweatshirt because yes, it's like June. It gets still cold. Like we have some cold nights. We go camping every year. So I wanted to make sure that he had a big fluffy sweatshirt. And I did get this in six to nine months, but it is so soft and so comfortable and I really don't think I even paid a lot for this at all. So I just kind of wanted to rave about this sweatshirt for a hot moment. Not sponsored, like they're not telling me, like they don't even know I bought this product, you know what I mean? But it is awesome and I like sharing good finds with you guys, it is so comfortable. I keep this basically in his diaper bag um, cause you never know when you're going to need a sweater. So I just wanted to show that. Let's go ahead and get right in. I have a lot a lot of outfits to show you guys and I have an order summary. So hopefully, um, oh good, nothing has prices. Okay. Well, <laughs> I was going to tell you prices as I went, but that literally just tells me the quantity of each item. So, um, let us just go ahead, jump right in. So this is the first one that I'll show you all of Ella's first. Um, she actually wore this one today, but she only wore it for like a minute or two because I thought it was going to be warmer out today than it actually was. But this is so flipping cute. She looked adorable. Honestly, if it's warm enough tomorrow, I'm going to put her back into it. So it's a two piece set and I really liked that they had like matching sets for kids. Um, but it's a two piece set. So she has this little polka dot bottoms, right? It has like a stretchy waistband back, not stretchy in the front. It does have pockets. Oh, which she used. Oh yeah. I forgot that she painted or drew a picture today. So she has pockets. Let me make sure she didn't put anything else in this other one. Uh, and then it has just a tie in the front. Uh, so you can see 
It has extra fabric here for like a little belt. Kind of, kind of frumpy, windbreakery material. Really, really light. Uh, and then the mat, the top, is this little off the shoulder white top. TJ is something just so you know, because you'll definitely hear him in the background because he doesn't be quiet for my videos. <laughs> but this is the top, so it is off the shoulder, but like, you know what I mean? Like the kids don't have to wear it off the shoulder, so it does either sit like that or if you wanted to, you can wear it off the shoulder. But yeah, it is really, really cute and it's really stretchy and my daughter was like so not used to off the shoulder stuff, but she really liked it. Like she was wearing it off the shoulder, but when she wanted to play, she was able to wear it like that, so. And then it does come with a little like headband. So what I'm actually gonna do tomorrow is she's gonna wear this outfit and then I'm gonna put her hair up. I hate you so much. I'm gonna put her hair up in like a little sock bun and I think it would look really, really cute to tie, like, oh, well, not around her neck, but like tie it up like that. <laughs> so that is the first outfit. Again, she tried it on. This was, um, I don't know the size on it. It was, it fit her really nice. Honestly, I could have maybe gone a size bigger, but again, I ordered this two months ago. Okay, it doesn't say the size. This is called the three-piece fashionable off-shoulder pom-pom flounced top and polka dots pants set. That's Holy smokes, name. yeah. In case you guys are looking for that particular outfit, go you ahead. Lost them, uh, at the 12th word. I said pom poms, polka dots. If you search pom pom polka dots, I'm sure you guys will find it. Okay. I'm... Oh, this is Hunter's. I don't think Hunter is going to fit in any of this stuff I bought him. Of course not. They're all three to six because I ordered them two months ago. So you I'm going to have to return them. Soon. No, I'm going to re just return them like a normal customer tee, but I'm so I bummed out. We'll still look at everything, but. I think that's Hunter is. Okay, let me just show you guys this next. So most of it, if not all of it, is all sets. I don't think I bought any single pieces. I did go on again and like add a few things to my cart. Like I have like a pair of shoes in there for Ella and one single dress. I haven't really had time to check out more, but I know you can buy single pieces. But I thought this was super cute. A lot of the times we're just kind of lounging around the house, but it's still hot. So she has this set. So it says love. And it's like a little, um, I don't want to call it a jogger set, but it's a little hair short. Like something that you would wear at the gym, you know what I mean? And then she has this little um, sports top that also says love. So simple. Next we will pull out, oh, I think this is another one of my favorite. Oh, oh, the gray set, by the way. Oh, oh. <laughs> this might be the two-piece solid, solid letter print top in a short set. I'm gonna assume that's what that one is. So this next one was one of my favorites. Again, it is a set. It's a pants, pants in like a top set. So the pants, oh, these are flipping so cute. Why don't these come? Maybe they do come in my size, but here's the pants, really similar to the polka dot ones I just showed you, just obviously a different pattern. This one has a stretchy waistband all, all around it, but it does have the belt to tie in the front again so we have that and then we have the matching top oh my god <laughs> look at how cute our five-year-old daughter's gonna wear that ah! with the high-waisted pants so that, that with the high-waisted pants i might steal it from her but from the high-waisted pants it's cute it that one is really cute i love I the color disapprove. it's kind of like a it's not like like pink pink. It's kind of like a salmony pink, but um, I approve. Daddy doesn't approve, but I approve. I do so. think it's cute, but like on you maybe. I, her whole belly is not gonna be exposed, T. I hate it. So that one is called the floral print. Maybe not. Maybe the bow knot strappy top and floral all over pants set. I'm gonna assume that because this has the tie bow knot strappy top and the floral pants. So check that one out. Uh, next, I think this one actually might be a dress. Let's see, let's see. Oh, it is a dress. Oh, okay, so I had Ella. She actually picked this one up. Daddy, do you approve of this one? It's just a unicorn dress. Yeah, that's great. Good enough. Great coverage. <laughs> Simple dress, yeah, and really, she's <laughs> really thin. So it has the unicorn on the front, butterflies on the back. Um, she's really into unicorns right now. Let me see if this says the size. Still no size on it, but 
I mean, it definitely, this will definitely fit her. I was just curious if I got fives or sixes. She still fits inside fives, but definitely transitioning into sixes. So I was just curious. That one is called the Beautiful Unicorn and Butterfly Pattern Sleeveless Dress. You know, all of this only costed me like $120 for like 10 oh, outfit. For 10 outfits, T? Like. Dana, you and I have a different definition of the word only. Oh, this is a cute one. This is another set. Let me see if I can find what this one is called. I think this one is the Sweet Ruffle Collar Tank Top and Short Set. So here's the shorts. Little tiny pair of cute, roughly shorts. These are ador adorable. Um, again, stretchy waistband. And so far, I've, I've kind of been noticing a pattern with the stretchy waistband. So that's really nice. If you're not really sure about sizes or you're kind of in between sizes, um, you can keep that in mind and maybe go... I don't know. It can stretch for you. Very nice. Those come with this little top here. This top has the bows in the front, like little white bows in the front. I'm not quite sure how well you can see it. Definitely has like crease marks in the shirt at the moment, but very nice. This one may also be another dress, another unicorn dress. She's going to freak out when she sees all these tomorrow. But another like big rainbow, like this This one is much busier than the other one, but this one has like floating castle on clouds, the rainbow, like a big unicorn kind of theme. Oh, sorry, no, no, no. They're alicorns because they have uh, horns and wings. If I don't get that right, she will correct me. This is the lovely unicorn pattern sundress. Coming down to our last about five or six outfits. Oh, nope, there's two on the floor. Sorry. <clears throat> oh, this one's Hunter's. We're gonna put that one aside. For oh, so I did just get a single item. I forgot that I got Ella just a little plain pair of jogger pants. These are really nice. When she was in gymnastics, um, they were really nice to have like pants like this because she would just wear the leotard to practice and then I would throw on like a pair of joggers. She has a similar pair um, that I got from Target that are just black, but these seem a little bit thinner that I really like, and I like that we have a gray pair as well. Um, she will be starting gymnastics again just at the moment. They're not allowing siblings in, and I can't take TJ's at work when she goes to gymnastics, so I don't have a sitter. So it's not like she's just not doing gymnastics anymore. I just kind of have to wait until the policies ease up a little bit. I think these are just called simple letter print pants. Those are the only things that I see that just says pants. Couple more items. This one probably won't, daddy won't approve again. I don't, I don't, I don't know what the bottoms look like, but here's the top. Red stripey floral top. And then the bottoms are Oh, just another little pair of high-waisted red shorts. Once again, stretchy waistband, and then the ties in the front. They're ties uh, to make a like bow a in the bad front. Job making no, so it'd be <laughs> it would be a high high shorts, and I'm telling you, I swear to God, like I'm gonna steal all of her clothes. Like I'm pretty sure. I can fit in this. <laughs> I'm gonna do all of her school clothes shopping this year, but I'm probably gonna order them like now because how considering how long this took me. Honestly, she's pretty good. There's definitely some things that she cannot wear to first grade in here, um, but the dresses would be totally fine. So I might buy like a couple pants and tops that I can kind of mix match. So if you see another Pat Pat haul within the, maybe the end of August, you early start? September, yeah, I did. It's called Pat Pat? Pat Pat. Oh, that... No, it's literally called Pat Pat. That was the joke part. Sorry. Sorry. You're not funny. <laughs> All right, a couple more. Oh, I think I got Hunter maybe five items. Oh, my goodness. Okay, Ella looks like we have another pair of jeans for Ella. Maybe this is not a set, but this looks like maybe the last girl's item. Oh, these are cute. <gasps> these are adorable. Okay, you definitely. Oh, those are really cute. These are cute, <laughs> right? Like the little scratch marks underneath. Oh, I didn't even see that. Okay, so they have little kitty ears on the knees. Just stretchy. I hate finagling with kids' buttons and zippers. It's just, it's a nightmare. So stretchy pants are definitely appreciated. Um, I think she's really, really gonna like these. These look big, but then when she puts them on, they always fit. So, oh, and it has little scratch marks on the butt. They too. cost so much because they use the fanciest bags ever. 
That was really cheap. I spent like 120 something dollars. I think shipping was free. Um, but for this amount of clothes, cat design jeans for kids. Really easy if you want to check that out. All right, the next couple of items unfortunately are really cute, so I am going to show you, but I really, I'm going to try one of the outfits on him tomorrow, and if they don't fit, I'm just going to send them back. So I'm going to make uh, sure that I keep this, make sure I keep the packaging. That, that's what you mean by unfortunately cute, because... No, they're wicked good. cute. Like some of the stuff that I got him, but I just don't think they're going to fit. They didn't come in on time, so... He has this little, <laughs> look how cute. So these are my son. My son is, he'll be five months at the end of June, uh, but he's a whopper. You know what I mean? He's 18 pounds already. He, he fits in six to nine months clothing, but Don't this, like, a whopper, he is a whopper, but some, are you serious? That motorcycle woke Hunter up earlier, so I'm still not over it. Anyways. Really cute. Honestly, this actually looks like it might fit. Um, so it might look like the products run a little bit bigger. Hopefully, I'm keeping my fingers crossed. Why does it come with a bow? Oh, it's a bow tie. Oh my God. It's a little bow tie. Oh my I think it goes around the button and then it comes with- doesn't match at all. You know what? Honestly, I might keep this because even if the shirt doesn't fit, I'll donate the shirt to, there's a pregnancy care center that I just donated a ton of kids clothes to. Are you really gonna chop on Cheez-Its right now? No, I'm being quiet. <laughs> You guys, this isn't my fault. I only get one opportunity to film and he's ruining it, but no. I might keep this um, at least for the pants because I know those will fit him. Next, it looks like a little pair of overalls. Oh my God. <laughs> like why do I order stuff and then still love it? This might well, actually well. fit. Well, yeah, well. like some of the stuff, it doesn't look that bad. I'm well, actually can you excited. Please be sure it was wearing it. It Can he so please cute. be shirtless wearing that? Yeah. We need to find a piece of hay. Yeah. But it's so cute. <laughs> All right, I, I'm a little more hopeful than I was at the beginning of this um, video that this stuff may fit him. But he needs to wear this like now. Uh, and then we have another little set, I think. Oh, I'm sorry, I haven't even been telling you. So the Hawaiian shirt, I found this. the suspenders are actually um, unisex. They're marketed toward boy, boys or girls, but this is called the front pocket solid denim suspender shorts. I don't know what this one is called. Maybe floral print short sleeve shirt and solid pants set. Absolutely. But you I open feel it like as a pair of pants. I and know, that's a but floral I feel shirt. like I already said that. I don't know, guys. Search for baby Stop. You just, yeah, it's a floral shirt. <laughs> this one is definitely called the elephant print short sleeve tee and striped pants set. What because makes you think that? There's a big elephant oh, on yeah. it. There's a big elephant, baby blue color. The elephant is in white. As you can see, everything's going to need a tiny bit of TLC with an iron, but two seconds and then that will be fine. And that comes with this <sighs> little white and black striped so cute. Short set in his camp. I love that. Last two items. Oh, okay. here's that little bow. I'm commentating. I'm a commentator. TJ's a YouTuber now. No, I'm just a master video editor. This might be Miss Ella's. No. no. It okay. goes with the shirt. <laughs> I know. I, I thought it looked feminine for a second, I but it's say. not. That's adorable. <laughs> this, is, this is the cactus. This one was called shirt and pants set. So you can see it has cactuses on it and like mustard yellow teepees. So you know, and then it has... You reminded me of a gorilla just a second ago. Why? When you had your arms like this, like to the side of your reading, all I could hear... Okay. <laughs> My husband's comparing me to an orangutan. No, not an orangutan. Oh, he doesn't like that, that word. word. <laughs> I, no. The orangutan. Don't you dare. <laughs> That's that set. And last but not least, oh, no. until August or September. What? Oh. Look, 14 items. 14 out. Somebody please tell me you can buy 14 outfits Keep for $120. They can't hear me. That's why I buy a baby monitor. No, 14 items for $120. Just saying. This last set is the dinosaur print short sleeve shirt and pants set. All that stuff might fit. I feel like everything looks I know, big. everything looks big. Like, it runs bigger. So if you're buying for a baby, honestly, I mean, I, I, I was worried that he wasn't going to fit in any of this. But I, I think he will. So it's just a, just a simple dinosaur 
um, short sleeve and then we have matching orange pants but what I really like about all this is that like a lot of it yeah you can wear it as a set but like like these crop tops you know what I mean like if it's a colder day you can throw a jacket on and the kitty pants that I'm holding in my other hand something like that so I really like like I got 14 outfits but in reality, I got a lot of really cool pieces. So I will say my first experience with this website, it didn't seem scammy. I was a little worried because I'm like, it seems a little too good to be true. The quality of the material doesn't seem like you sort of get what you pay for it's sort of thing. It's not Egyptian cotton, that's for sure. <laughs> it's not Egyptian cotton. But you have to remember that like, A, kids go through outfits like water in a month Hunter will not fit in any of this, so I've paid the price for what I'm getting. I am gonna be able to get my full use out of these clothing and then they will move on and either uh, go to somebody else in need for them because they're really, really cute items. They're just not like top quality material. They're no worse than like what, what you would buy at like a Target. Like you're not like getting ripped off, definitely not, but it's not... <laughs> it's a little family guy. I don't know. It, it's not like high end as well. I think it's super affordable. I think these outfits are absolutely adorable. And I was able to buy a little bit more than what I usually would because of the price. Now, I can't say that this is Pat Pat's fault. Nobody saw COVID coming. The fact that this took almost two months to get to me, yeah, it was disappointing. Ridiculous. I really wanted Ella to wear these clothes like at the beginning of spring. That's okay, she's gonna fit into these. Um, what a throw! <laughs> <laughs> I literally hate you. <laughs> I'm gonna finish my video with this, Jess. Can that know. be the tag thing? The little picture tag in the front? What's it called? A thumbnail. Oh, picture tag. The, the, the picture tag of the video. <laughs> a thumbnail. It's why do they call something as gross as a thumbnail in reference to a picture? Thumbnails are nasty. Can't tell you. I've never seen one person with a good looking thumbnail. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Um, again, I, you know, I, I, it wasn't Pat Pat's fault for how long this took. Like I said, because it took so long, I definitely want Ella to have some of these items when she goes back to school. So I'm going to raid her closet when I put this stuff away. I already pretty much stay on top of her clothes, but I'm gonna see, does she need really anything else going into the new school year next year? And if she does, I'm gonna browse the website. I'm also gonna look for all of Hunter's winter clothes on here. I'm really excited, but honestly, I'll probably order it now. That way I have it, hopefully when September comes. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I know you can't comment down below because you're on my main channel, but you can find the thumbnail on my community tab. Leave any of your... Sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna go, guys. I love you so much. And as I was saying, you can go to my community tab, find the thumbnail of this video, and leave your comment there. Um, I just felt like it was most appropriate to have this video on my main channel where we focus on family here. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please go ahead, leave a like. Also, if you don't wanna miss any new videos, hit that subscribe button while you're down there, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.